What's up everybody? It's that time again. We're going to be doing another YouTube meetup. Yes, you can meet up if you don't have a YouTube channel. The more, the merrier. We're all getting together September 1st, 2018. This time we're going to be going to two places in one day. They're only 3.4 miles away from each other, so I'm going to leave the information, the addresses, and the day, everything you need to know in the description below. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you short little clips on how to get there and what they have to offer. So, let's check it out. All right, so first on the list is gonna be Reefco. If you're headed 22 eastbound and you are driving, as soon as you see the STS, Put your blinker on, start to slow it down because the parking lot is big but there's one way in and a one way out so you do not want to miss the turn and have to go all the way down and do a U-turn and do another U-turn. So with the blinker on, when you see the greenhouse with all the gnomes and stuff up front, bang a right and directly straight in front of you all the way at the end of the building is Reefco. It's a nice little store. The store business hours are normally only Saturdays and Sundays from 11 to 5. He's gonna be opening the door for us September 1st at 10 a.m. We're getting in there an hour early to do our thing, do some shopping, shoot some videos, and uh, just hang out and talk like we always do when we do meetups. The store is about a year old. He does have a good, a good section for fish, um, a huge section for coral, and then another smaller section for dry goods. So he's got a little bit of everything and it is a reef related store. So anything reef related, this is the place for you. He does have seven 100 gallon frag tanks that are usually filled to the brim, front to back, side to side. Very clean system. The owner is gonna be there, so he will be there to answer any questions. You can chat with him. It's gonna be a fun time. So if you've never been to Reef Co before, we're gonna be there from about 10 a.m. to about 12.30, one o'clock, and uh, you know, just hanging out and uh, looking at all the frags. There's a lot to look at, so we're gonna definitely need at least two hours, because with all the chit-chatting and shopping and chit-chatting and shopping, so definitely try to be there at 10 a.m., because that's when uh, most of us are gonna be getting there, so. That concludes the very short tour of Reefco. I hope to see you guys there. Now, let's take a trip down the road. Like I said, 3.4 miles. When you're on 22 East, look for the Exxon gas station, put your blinker on, and get ready to bang a right. Pulling into the building, it's very, it's very big building. It's, uh, it's hard to miss. Big brown building with the green awnings and the huge coral window logos. So, if you haven't been to this store before, this is a father-son um, store. They have a huge selection of reefs, um, coral, fish, inverts, and um, plenty, plenty to choose from. So if you are looking for specifically for reef stuff, which most of us probably will be, you definitely want to come hang out and meet up with us there. Um, the owner, Gary, is gonna be there as well to answer any type of questions. And he's gonna hang out with us. Um, look at that octopus they have in there. That thing was creepy and crazy. They do have a lot of little fish and a lot of little frag tanks. Uh, I wish somebody would buy that big clam. It's been there for a while, but yep, yeah, they have lots and lots of huge tanks with huge colonies um, packed to the brim. And then they also have, you know, dry rock, carob sea shapes, which is awesome if you've never seen the shapes before, they have a huge selection there. So definitely highly recommend um, Ocean Gallery. Like I said, we'll probably be there between, I'm thinking like one or 1.30 until, you know, whenever anybody wants to leave. I believe they're gonna be open till six or seven o'clock um, on Saturday to the day that we are gonna be there. Now, this store is not just a reef store. They do have a lot of freshwater fish to choose from. They do have a good selection of driftwood and plants and also dry goods for freshwater fish. They also do have a spot downstairs for ponds. So if you have a pond outside, they have just about everything you could ask for and some pretty nice kois. I saw a lot of nice ones in there. 
They also have a, a little spot upstairs with new and actually used tanks. It's kind of like a, a tank graveyard, but you never know what you'll find there. And a reptile section for anybody who likes reptiles. So that is it for this video. Um, I hope to see you guys there September 1st. Like I said before, check out the description below. It's going to have all the date and times and directions. I will see you guys there, and I will see you guys on the next one. Later.